For the second time this year, this peaceful neighborhood has experienced gun violence. Residents tell me they want answers. Bibb investigators say one house on Friar Tuck Lane has been shot at twice in 2022. Been here eight years and for it to happen twice like that, you know, the next door is kind of scary. And recently it has become a war zone. Michael Mitchell has lived directly next door to that house, raising his five young children. He cares deeply for their safety and he's concerned. When they get to shooting, we can't do nothing but just hit the, hit the floor, you know, until we hear them peel off. I heard, I don't know how many shots it was. You know, it sounded like a machine gun from the old movies. Just a few houses away, you'll find Angie Horn. She built her home in Lake Wildwood more than 30 years ago and like Mitchell, raised her children here. She says the violence in the area is surprising. I can't ever say I've ever lived anywhere in my whole life that twice I've been this close to gunfire. Mitchell says Monday night shooting couldn't have lasted more than 30 seconds, but... Seeing them jumping and everything, it kind of made it seem like five minutes. He knows it's enough time for someone to get seriously hurt. I said, y'all hit the floor, hit the floor, stay in the room, stay in the room. Ultimately, both neighbors want to see an end to the violence. I really wish the sheriff's department would have a little bit more presence. I can't tell you last time... I saw one just patrolling. We don't know when they're going to come back because they, they, they didn't get caught. So the only thing we hope that, you know, whatever issue that's going on, that it be solved away from here. Nothing's going to run us out. We're going to have to run them out. In Macon, Ramey Cohen, 13 WMEZ News.